big PR and hammer, and it was really exciting to see uh, a lot of my practice throws finally paying off and getting a big throw in the meet. So it was a good start. I'm excited to see where I'll go this season. The meet was all right, but it wasn't really anything I was looking for. I was just glad for the win at the end of the day. Um, it wasn't really a performance to really talk about, but the win is always nice, um, especially competing against somebody who had a good legacy at ASU and you were able to beat them, you know, so it shows it shows where I'm at right now, really and truly. So um, I'm just really kind of more excited for next week because I mean, at least I have my foot in the door and I know what could happen from here now. Well, it's a great day, weekend for the Sun Devils. It really started off well yesterday with the hammer. Kyle Long had a 21-foot PR. Uh, Maggie Ewan had a big PR in the, in the women's hammer as well. Translated into the evening. Ryan Hurston ran 344 in the 1500. Equates to a 401 miler. Transferred in today. We had a great start with the men. Uh, Jamal James had a lifetime best 24-5 in the long jump. Came back and ran 1044 and won the 100. And we really had a, a very solid day on both sides. On the women's side, uh, uh, it's always interesting to see. Uh, Chelsea Todd came back from a nice 1500 last night and doubled back in the 800. So all in all, it was a great event. Uh, we had a chance for a little community service with our uh, kids program that our, our student athletes did a clinic for them for them. And so we look forward to the uh, Pac-12 Big Ten Challenge next week.